Hello, everyone. It's a pleasure to be here today and to be talking to all of you. You guys are a lot. Um, it's truly fantastic to see that a great number of women is speaking at this conference, and I'm really, really happy to share the stage with them. So first things first, my name, first things first, my name is Lavinia Meliti. I'm the global head of business development at IPWE. And as my accent cle clearly reveals, I definitely cannot hide it. I'm Italian. <laughs> I'm a lawyer both in uh, Europe and in the United States. And yes, I know what you're thinking. Lawyers are renowned for being super boring. In my case, it will be double the boring. But please rest assured that it's not my intention to bore you out today. So why is this lawyer working in business and technology, you might be asking yourselves. Digital transformation is harnessing technology to change the way we do business. The simple truth is that in the age of disruption, we can't imagine a future without technology and without innovation. The pace of innovation today is, in fact, faster than any point in human history, because we're talking about $2 trillion globally. Now, I think we can all agree that we live in a world of breathtaking digital transformation, right? But we can also agree that, you know, the value of innovation is not recognized. You know, many of our bright, high potential innovators with tech startups are struggling to survive. Three out of four startups will fail. And so now more than ever, we must, you know, create the right incentives and the right environment for innovators. And we at IPWE see innovation as a positive force for change. But first, let me tell you a little bit more about IPWE and who we are. IPWE is a decentralized innovation platform. We have built the tools to reduce the complexities that make innovation hard. So over the past three years, we have spent approximately $50 million developing AI and blockchain and used Hyperledger and Casper to build the first innovation transaction platform. Through our tech-enabled platform, we strive to empower organizations to drive their innovation home, giving a voice and a role to everyone in the innovation process. Now, as you can see here from the slide, we mentioned patent NFTs. And why is that? We introduced patent NFTs into the process, which makes utilizing and transacting in innovation, so transacting in intellectual property, much more cost efficient. And why is that? Because today's process requires attorneys, contracts, and a lot of paperwork. By using NFTs, the entire model gets simplified because everything is centralized in one place, in one secure repository, in one location. Now, what's our mission? And this is going to be a rhetorical question. Everyone wants to invest in the next big thing before everyone else, right? But how do you find the next big thing? New tech areas have emerged from the shadows of speculation into broad daylight, representing a huge potential in the global economy. And yet, they remain grossly underestimated and not utilized. So companies that are poorly positioned vis-a-vis -vis innovation and don't quickly respond to it are headed for a long and secular decline. And yet, why are these companies that have the potential to disrupt left behind? Because they do not have the tools or the resources to innovate, perhaps? Well, we at IPWE want innovation in the tech sphere to be tangible and available to everyone. And this is why we've come up with the Smart Pool program. It is a program, a wonderful program, that strives to democratize patents by allowing patent owners, tech leaders, to share them with businesses who will make the best use of them, thereby leading to what we hope will be a global increase in innovation. Now, at IPWE, we focus on emerging technology. So we focus on tech areas that are very early in the adoption cycle. And here, you just have a few of them quantum computing, barcode technology, electric vehicles, and metaverse. We just announced the metaverse smart pool. Metaverse that is expected to become a one trillion market by 2028. 
Now today, the reason why I'm here is to officially make an announcement on behalf of my company, IPWE. And I want to officially announce the Blockchain Innovation Program. Blockchain that, according to PwC, is going to boost the global GDP by 1.76 trillion by 2030. It goes without saying that more partnerships are required in the blockchain sphere. And this is what we have for you. We're engaging with some of the biggest blockchain patent holders in the world who are contributing their patents, who are contributing their technology to make it available to everyone. We've got them in Japan, in China, in Europe, and in the United States so far. Patents no longer exclude innovation. To the contrary, they want to encourage global cooperation. Who can be part of this? All of you present here today and online can become members of the blockchain smart pool, as well as any other tech area you're interested in. And it doesn't matter if you're a small, a medium, or even a large enterprise. As members, you simply get to pay a membership fee based on your revenue tier. Once that's done, you get a license to all the top patents contributed by tech leaders in the space so that you have freedom to innovate. You benefit from freedom to operate and you respond in RFPs. Now, this is the most important part for us, SMEs and startups. And why is that? Tech innovation is frequently unavailable to SMEs due to budget constraints and obviously the competition that large companies represent. That's where IPW comes in. We want to give SMEs the chance to pursue innovation efforts. So we're currently giving an unprecedented opportunity to SMEs that have an annual revenue of $1 million. They can get a free membership in our Smart Pool program, which means free licenses to top industry patent portfolios. Now, you may wonder, OK, Lavinia, what if my revenue then gets up to $10 million? Well, in that case, you get to pay $500 per year. Does it sound too good to be true? Sure, it does. But so did most of the contemporary tech 30 years ago. So while others are focused in the past, innovators like you are focused in the future. And that's why we're all here today. So to conclude, it was Steve Jobs who said that Innovation is the only way to win. I trust that you're all winners here. And our aim is to help you win. So come to say hi after the conference, or shoot me an email. You can find it here if you want to learn more. And remember, innovation is the calling card for the future. Thank you very much for having me. The video!